we'll start with opening our web browser in the address bar. We will type our IP address at the top here. Login screen, we'll type in our department ID and then the pin. Click login. The main portal here, we'll go over to our settings registration button. And on the lower left hand side under management settings, we're going to go to license on it. And back up in the top here, we're going to go to remote UI settings. And here's where we can enable TLS for the remote user interface. So we'll just click on this box to put the check mark next to use TLS. And we'll click on the OK button. And then over on the left here, right above preferences, we'll click on apply setting changes. And we'll need to restart to apply these changes. So we'll click on the restart button. And it's going to give you the status of everything. And we'll click over here on the perform restart button. It's going to ask if you're sure if you want to uh, restart. We'll click on OK. And now we wait for the device to restart. Now, if we look at the top here, we are using HTTPS. Um, some of your browsers will say not secure here because the Canon certificate is not completely trusted by some browsers, but it is using TLS and it is using HTTPS. 